Which is bittersweet. Uh, you walking away with the title, but uh, lost in the last game. How do you see today's match specifically? Yeah, look, I thought today was an, another another great game of cricket. Um, hard fought by both teams. Um, obviously, really disappointing in those games to be on the, the wrong side of the result. But again, I think um, some of the challenges we faced over here in these conditions is going to be great for us as a team moving forward. And I think a lot of credit has to go to. Nepal for the cricket they've played uh, throughout the series and again today. For the first game you had rested your key players but today you went all grounds blazing but uh, do you think this is the right call before the important World Cup qualifiers that you're going to play in Zimbabwe? Um, I think not, not too much change from the, the approach we normally have. Um, I think obviously it, as a team, we want to be we want to be playing a positive brand of cricket. Um, I think it's important that we do that, especially if we want to beat some of the, the full member teams, because that's how we've beat them previously. We've been willing to play that way. Um, so I say, although we didn't get the right result today, we've shown a lot of good signs. Um, it's just maybe a case of executing uh, or being more disciplined for for longer periods in the game. Um, but there's still there's still so many positives to take from it. How do you summarize your uh, league to qualify journey from the f day, match one to this uh, last match of the six? How do you see this journey? Yeah, look, it's been an uh, incredible, incredible tournament uh, to be part of. Um, great that we've had so many different games to play in different conditions. Um, we've certainly faced some very challenging conditions, um, but I think that's helped us grow as a team and as a, a group of players. So. And I think that's probably the case for all the teams that have been involved. There's been some great cricket played. Um, every series has been hard fought, as we've seen again here. Um, so it's been an incredible experience. And obviously for us, we're, there's a lot of hard work that's gone in um, on the field, but also off the field, uh, not only by the players, but the support staff as well. So to reach that goal is very special. Um, but we know there's still a lot of ahead of us um, and we can take a lot from the journey we've been on um, moving, moving forward. Nepal were the only team to beat Scotland three times in this series. Do you think they can make it to the World Cup qualifiers and meet again? How do you rate Nepal's? Uh, look, as I said, a lot of credit has to go to Nepal for the cricket they've played uh, throughout the series. We knew they were going to be a tough opponent, especially in their home conditions. Um, and I've, I've no doubt the remaining games are going to be hard fought. As I said, all the all the games throughout this tournament have been have been tough. There's been no, no easy games, so it should be really interesting to see how that unfolds. Um, they'll, Nepal will obviously be very confident the way they're playing their cricket at the moment, so yeah, it'll be exciting to see um, to see which team's going to manage to get that uh, second and third place. Uh, obviously, a lot to play for. When you say home conditions, is it just the pitch or the surrounding, and especially the spectators? How do you rate this uh, performance of these spectators in your game? Yeah, look, I think obviously the. The conditions for us here are very different to what we're used to. Um, so as I say, we knew uh, Nepal were going to be being used to the home conditions. We're going to be it's going to be a tough challenge. Um, I think the support they have here from the home crowd is amazing. It's been incredible to see the passion uh, for the game over here, and as a whole, that we've had an incredible experience. Nepal, hopefully, something we're going to be able to do again in the future. Um, but I think for Nepal, um, yeah, it must give them a massive lift to have to have such a great home support like that. Yeah, look, I think you, you've, we've probably all seen uh, the difference. Obviously, the Scottish conditions are very, very different. And I, I probably as expected, we would, we would expect to dominate in, those, in our home conditions. So for us, I think it's just been it's been a great challenge and a great learning to come come over here and experience these types of conditions. Um, the Paul have obviously shown how well they can play at home. Um, but that, as we know, they're, they're a good team wherever they're playing. Um, but obviously, again, as I said, particularly at home, they, they know the conditions really well and they've played played some really good cricket throughout this series. So.